to all the teachers and students in KTTM. My name is Sumanjit Kaur from 6V6 and today I'll be talking about how does education system plays a role in a student's well-being. Test anxiety, depression, lack of energy and motivation, helplessness, low self-esteem, procrastination, perfectionism and time management. These are some of the issues students these days struggle with and for many, the root of these problems is education. Now, do not take this negatively because I am not bad-mouthing education itself. It is the education system, I believe, which affects our everyday lifestyle. I, for one, was ready to pack my bags and migrate to Finland at the age of 12 after hearing about the education system. Reward as the best education system in the world, Finland has meticulously curated an apparatus for academia and learning that is at par with almost all the countries around the globe. Emerging as an intellectual in the domain of education, the Finnish education system is meant to have cracked the code of imparting quality education and following the motto of eternal learning. Question is, what is eternal learning? The bigger question is, how did they achieve that? And the most important question is, how does it affect students? Let's dive in deeper on Finland's education system. Top 10 reasons why Finland has the best education system will include Number 1. Free education access from pre-primary to higher to Finnish citizens as well as to those coming from EU, EEA countries because education is considered as an equal right for everyone. Number 2. Implementation of holistic teaching and learning environment that aims to emphasize equity over excellence. Number 3. No standardized testing system as students are graded individually with a grading system created by the teacher. Also, overall progress is mapped by the Ministry of Education by sampling groups of varied ranges of schools. Number four, Finnish children begin their academic uh, journey at an older age. In example, um, only when they turn seven years old, they commence their schooling and before that, learning is made free flowing. Number five, the bar is higher for teachers. For instance, only master's degree holders from specialized teaching schools can opt for teaching positions and even then, an individual principal is allotted to every teacher to keep a tab in their progress. Number six, exemption from the artificial parameters of academic progress by removing any kind of competition between academic institutions but rather cooperation is made the norm. Number seven, Better alternatives to the same old degree as those planning for college education can choose from professional options, be it vocational schools, university education, or training classes. Number eight, focusing on fostering cooperation over competition. In schools, by inculcating the skills of teamwork, collaboration, and team spirit in students. Number nine, Emphasis on foundational basics is an important reason why Finland has the best education system in the world because students are provided with the time and scope to build the best foundations and basics at their own pace. Number 10, only 9 years of compulsory education is there in Finland's education system and after that students are encouraged to find out what's best for them academically and career-wise. As you can see, Finland has focused on a couple of areas in their education system. They have prioritized quality of education over speed. It is not about how fast the students are learning or how advanced their syllabus structure is. They have also considered how much time students would take to digest and understand everything they learned um, and taught by their teachers. Finland focused on hiring highly educated teachers as well, with mentors keeping track of the teacher's performance in class. Besides, students in Finland will never face a panic attack due to exam pressure. They have assessments based on the level of knowledge of students instead of age. So um, that way, they won't feel stressed out because they haven't completed studying that syllabus structure that was given by the Ministry of Education. So not to forget, um, Finland Ministry of Education also encourages students to pursue their higher education based on the niche they are passionate about. It can be vocational as well as university education. There is no better or worse when it comes to education and every field, no matter science or art stream, have equal importance. This beats the stereotypical Asian thinking whereby only science-related careers are acknowledged and any others like a business degree has zero to no value in their eyes. 
I have answered the question of how Finland has one of the world's best education system. Now let's see this education system. How does it promote eternal learning, and how does this affect students in general? Eternal learning is the ongoing, voluntary, and self-motivated pursuit of knowledge for either personal or professional reasons. There are many definitions of eternal learning on the internet, but to keep things simple, it is the kind of learning which sticks with you forever. That is because you were passionate when you learn it, and interest motivates you to research deeper and understand the topic thoroughly. Personally, I think it is the ideal way of learning in life. The key word here is interest and passion. These two words changes the perception of the learner and motivates one to feel curious and、um, to research more on the topic of their education. This way, students won't feel stressed or pressured into learning. Instead, their interest and passion will drive them to do better and better every day. In conclusion, I believe Finland's education system is a game changer to all the 21st century students. To be able to study without pressure, anxiety, or depression clouding our senses is just a dream come true. Students will be happier and be able to maintain a perfectly healthy mindset. And that is all from me today. Thank you very much for watching this video.